Um, she was really kind-hearted and bright. Uh, I knew her before pharmacy school. She was really driven. Friends gathered at the scene of the crime to remember four women who were shot to death yesterday in Tenley Park and what police are calling a brutal act of domestic violence. Now, charges are pending against the suspect who sources say is the husband and father of the victims. Our Dane Placco has the latest on the investigation from Tenley Park. This is a difficult day and a stark reminder of how quickly domestic violence can escalate. Tinley Park Police continue to investigate what triggered a man to murder his wife and three daughters on a quiet Sunday morning on a quiet residential street. We want to make sure that, uh, that the victims get the justice they deserve. We, we want to make sure that our investigation and the activities that we take in connection with that investigation are as complete and efficient as they can possibly be. What was your reaction when you heard about this I didn't believe tragedy? it. I didn't believe it. Today, friends of the victims gathered at the crime scene, placing flowers in front of the police tape surrounding the home. Most are students who went to pharmacy school at Chicago State University with 25-year-old Halema Kasim. Police also found the bodies of her twin sister, Zahia, their 24-year-old sister, Hanan, and their mother, 59-year-old Maheda Kasim. It feels honestly very unreal. It gives me chills, even though it's freezing out here, but, like, I just can't believe something so terrible happened inside those walls. The Cook County Medical Examiner's Office says all four women were shot multiple times, and police here have recovered the gun that was used. As for the motive... If this was, in fact, domestic violence, it's not unusual for these situations to progress to the point of um, taking a life. Advocates for domestic violence victims say it's likely the killer had a history of using violence and authority to exert his will over other members of the family. We do know that the family is of Arab descent, of Palestinian descent. Um, they are Muslim. And at this point, this has nothing to do with Islam or any other religion. Um, this is about power and control. This is about gender-based violence. Police say they're not aware of any warning signs. They had never been called to the home before. In Tinley Park, Dane Placco, Fox 32 Chicago.